An Idaho family and the Cashew County Sheriff are asking for your help tonight. They are looking for a man who chased down two kids on their bikes with his pickup truck through a Burley City Park. The attack caught on camera. Our Andrew Bartline was in Burley today to get us these astounding details and pictures. Now a lot of things go down in a skate park. There's some tricks, maybe some trash talk and a disagreement or two. But last Friday, a disagreement got so out of hand, it left two kids running for their life. At first, you kind of kind of like, OK, Nathaniel, you're kind of exaggerating a little bit. Some stories just aren't very believable at first, maybe because the details sound too out of the ordinary. He just told us that he was almost hit by a truck. Until you finally get the evidence. And I seen the video and I'm like, dude, you didn't say he was that close to you. No, Nathaniel wasn't exaggerating. He says he and his friend were at the skate park when he accidentally hit another kid with his bike. And then they started swearing. My friend TJ got mad, swore a couple times back. The Pawson family says the other group of kids got an adult involved, and it quickly escalated. Right as we saw him, we took off. He chased us from that corner all the way through to over there, and then that road that starts, he stopped there and sweared at us. The man got in his pickup truck and continued to chase the kids, eventually running over Nathaniel's bike. It was just probably the most scariest part of my life right there. Because if I would have messed up or anything, like if there was a rock in the road, I would have hit. Miss pedal, I could have been hit. And there was no time for him to stop because how fast he was going. I was just shocked. I, I mean, I couldn't believe that somebody would do something like that. There's nothing that the kids could have done that, to warrant that kind of reaction. Nathaniel's friend TJ had a family friend in the area, and the two boys ran inside her home to hide from the man. And that same woman reported the event to the police. There is absolutely no way I could ever thank her enough for what she did. There's nothing I could do that would amount to what she did for my child. It just makes you wonder, like, what was his end game? Like, what was his plan? Like, what was he going for? I just want him found. I just know that. The family tells me that nobody was hurt, but the Cassia County Sheriff's Office says if anybody has any information to come forward. Reporting for Burley, Idaho, Andrew Bartline, Idaho's News Channel 7. You can see now why the entire city is talking about this. And if you have any information about the driver and can help, you're urged to report any information you may have to the Cassia County Sheriff. That number, 208-878-2251.